What did I buy today? Well, welcome to the channel. It's Randy's Attic, and today we're gonna look and see what I bought. But before that, I do invite you to hit the like and subscribe button, and uh, they're down here. They're not up here, they're down there. And uh, hit the like and subscribe button and become part of the channel. And uh, follow my journey as I buy guitars along the way. So let's look and see what I bought this time. So what is in this case? It's pretty old, that's all I know. Well, it's a Supro Belmont and beautiful mother of toilet seat pink. Guitar appears to be in pretty good shape. I don't know a whole lot about these guitars. I really, to be honest with you, I'm not a big uh, Supro and Tisco and all those uh, pawn shop fine guitars like Will Ray is, but I saw this and I said, I gotta have this. This is kind of cool. I said, at least I could use the tuners off of this thing if this thing didn't play or work or whatever. Uh, the tuners are the same tuners that you would get on an old Les Paul Jr. or a uh, Melody Maker or something like that. These are single line, by the way. If you look here, these are single line Clusons. It's what they had in the uh, anywhere from the 50s on on up to uh, the mid 60s. They, then they switched to double line Clusons. Look at this uh, neck plate. How do you take the neck off? I'm not really sure. That one's, uh, like I said, this one's a bizarre one to me. It's pretty, but bizarre. Very strange, very. Guitar appears to be a, probably around a 61, maybe 62, maybe 63. It, it's right in that era, probably probably closer to the 62 to 63. Tunematic bridge. Oh, no, I know that's not original. That's, that had one of those wood, funky wood bridges on it. So somebody replace that with a tunematic bridge huh but I believe the pickup is straight knobs look original pickguard definitely looks original huh definitely a strange little guitar well the Supro is interesting to say the least uh, what I normally Buy something like this? Generally, no. Just something I don't get that whole Tisco, Supro, some of the national stuff. Just the, some of, I just, yeah. Different time period for me growing up. But this one, it's mother of toilet seat, baby. I had to buy it. Mother of toilet seat guitars, some, for some reason, I just, think those are kind of cool. I don't know what it is, but just the the way they're made, you know, the, the resin guitars, those as well. I like those, you know, the, the Nationals and stuff like that. I, I don't know what it is, but I do like those as well. So I hope you've uh, liked this little journey down memory lane of the days of resin and mother of toilet seat guitars. <laughs> So we'll have plenty more of those. I do have a few more stashed away that I will uh, bring out and we'll look at those down the line here. So hope you enjoyed this. And until next time, guys, have a great one. Thanks for watching Randy's Attic. We'll see you next time.